Okay, it's smelled there by um by incense. Hi. Oh, so I do that. What am I doing? I have this cloth on this table and I hate it. No. Oh, Hi, I'm Tara. How are you? Just so you know, I'm doing live videos over on Facebook. And I'm getting, I'm getting quite the crowd over there compared to over here at YouTube. I'm very disappointed with this. I'm very disappointed with the YouTubing. I wonder what the reason is why it's like that. So, for those that are over here or know me from over on Instagram, if you go to my Facebook, I wouldn't suggest to add me as a friend because I'm almost at the capacity of 5,000 friends. So, just go on my channel. It's Channel Tarot Card Readings. I don't even know why I named it that. But I don't even like that name. And I've been trying to change it. And I, I seem like don't know how. So it's Aries' birthday, birthday month. So I did happy birthday to Aries for love. And then I'm going to do a money career for Aries. And I've done the 12 Zodiac signs for love reading for here on YouTube. So I'm going to go over to Facebook and do the 12 Zodiac signs for a love and career over there. Starting with Aries because it's their, still their birthday month. See how everyone's pentacles are doing. How's everyone's pentis doing? I'll tell you how mine are doing horrible. Horrible, I say. Oh, I I think my kids are supposed to go to school this week. I'm confused. To the school school. That's what I'm talking about. I think, to, I think April's, like, soon. Have you guys looked at the worm moon? I haven't looked at it really. I think it's cloudy now. If she's sleeping, let her go. Why can't you learn? I'm on, I'm on video. I want to see who's with us today. And I have a... Oh, really? I am on... Okay, well, go ahead, honey. I'm on this. Please, don't do what I had to do last night. I don't get... I don't understand why they do this to me every time.
pain. So I'm going to do the Isis Oracle cards today. If you're interested in a personal reading, email me. Everything's in this um, description. My email address, my my the name for my um, YouTube channel. I mean my Facebook channel and my cash app if you're feel guided to make a donation or like a personal reading um i do just regular mini readings channeled readings i can do pend um pendulums yes or no questions tarot or full activations I'm also a massage therapist so anybody local is interested in massage oh. Who's with us right now? with us right now. Cleopatra's with us. She's been with me. I think you can feel my energy. I should do, um, I should actually do, should I do the energy of my twin flame journey with the Isis cards? So I haven't done my, I haven't done a twin flame journey. Cleopatra, do you want me to do that? Okay, so um, let's first ask Archangel Michael to step in, Archangel Michael above us, Archangel Michael below us, Archangel Michael to our right, Archangel Michael to our left, Archangel Michael, Archangel Michael, Archangel Michael all around us, Archangel Michael, are you with us right now? I would love to feel your hugs, I would love to feel your warmth, if you can 
hug me. You and um, Cleopatra can both, I would love to feel both of you guys' hugs. I need a hug. I need a hug. I need a hug. Please. I appreciate a hug. He knows what number he is. This stuff's been burning real fast. I, don't, I wish they had like an incense store in my area. this um, amber stuff, this resin amber, it's supposed to come with this with frankincense. It's like so expensive. I don't know if I'm using too much of it. Very unsatisfied. I'm very. <laughs> All right, so. Twin Flame Journey. I like that. Because we're supposed to be uniting in about a week, seven days. He's um, in a place that's... Um, okay, I'll say. He is in the county jail here. <laughs> and... Unfortunately, due to COVID, the courthouse is closed down. Courthouse is closed down. a man in the county jail who's sitting indefinitely so the courthouse is open but they're supposedly going to be opening on April 4th Okay. Mm. 
I've already been on for 15 minutes. So yesterday I was burning the amber and my son said that his face felt hairy, that he felt hair all over his face. Now, I actually felt the same exact thing. I'm not feeling it today though. I wonder what the, I, I have to Google see what that means. So it's weird that we both felt that. How is everyone? I feel like, like I haven't been, it's like I've been on for 15 minutes. I feel like I haven't been here. Make my lights. <laughs> I just have a yes or no question. I just want to give a happy birthday to Anita Frankenfield. It was her birthday the other day. Chad told me and I didn't read his email. I'm sure that upset him because I didn't acknowledge it for him. I need him to understand that I... He has to. So I'm going to calm down. Okay. Alrighty. Are we ready? Alright, this is going to be the twin flame journey. Let's see where the energies are for me and him. Um, I also have a question. Okay. Oh, Archangel Michael above us, Archangel Michael below us, Archangel Michael to our right, Archangel Michael to our left, Archangel Michael, Archangel Michael, Archangel Michael. I tell, ask you to please step forward for my highest good, for the highest good of my viewers. I need you to step forward now. Take your shield, cover my home, cover my entire street, cover my backyard, cover my back alley. Oh, my loved ones, my children, anybody that turns this channel on that's a part of this channel, cover them immediately. It doesn't matter if it's today, tomorrow, five years, ten years, a hundred years from now. Anyone that turns on this channel is immediately covered and protected by the Archangel Michael. And he will cut all cords of negativity, anything that's dark, evil, that no longer serves anyone. It will be released. I believe tonight is actually the worm mole, worm <laughs> worm, worm moon, full moon. So let's. So Archangel Michael does live in this home. He has angels at on my windowsills, at my doors, at my archways. They're all over. They're protecting me. I do have the um, Egyptian gods, goddesses in my home um, also. They are here to protect me. I am highly, highly, highly protected by the entire angelic realm, the Egyptian gods. I, this, I don't know. It's... I mean, people say, oh, that's normal. That's what lights do. They, they pull out of the mirror and come to your face and start, you know. Hello. <laughs> it's like, can I? <laughs> oh, I feel like I feel it. Like I
Okay. That's why now, Archangel Michael, you are here to protect us right now. Just give me your number, please. Thank you. Hey, Apatra, you here? Okay, um, unions coming up, judgment, justice, all that, for my highest good, I need to know the energy of where we're going here, I am ready for all truths to be shown at me, so, not a shocker there. Please. Well, we'll be coming, in, coming into union on April 5th, I believe it is. It's April 4th or 5th that Monday. Hmm. Is this a good choice for me? my justice coming up with my karma. thing has counted many. I've asked many times if I'm Cleopatra because something's going that way. Everyone says yes. Okay. 
I want to start. Mm-hmm. I got to finish, finish up another reading tonight for a friend also. Like, everyone's readings have been horrible. So, we're going to do, like, no more than three or four cards. Okay, Petra, if that's okay. And this is for my... The energy of a twin flame journey. Okay? This is the energy of a twin flame journey. Of me and my twin flame. Why is it get this... Oh. Oh. Can you even see it? Mm. So I got the, the things, and I don't. I neither of them will open for me. I want to figure it out. If you can open it, I would. That'd be awesome. Like I, I turned it, I turned that way, I went that way, and then I went that way, and I can't unlock a lock, apparently. If you couldn't hear me for, for those first 25 minutes, I apologize. Just wait, I'm going to shuffle five times and I'm going to go, okay? I'll count to five. Okay? No more than four cards. No more than three cards. Three cards. One, two, three. Okay? Can we, Can we do that? <laughs> Blink or something. Just something easier. All right. One, two... Three, four, Thank you. Thank you, my goddess. All right. Give me one second. <laughs> well, I was going to start over. <laughs> I got water. I had to go to the bathroom and I got a little snack. Because I felt like I could, like, from um where's all that cold air coming from oh, I'm sorry guys I'm sorry I just felt a big gust of wind I'm like what the heck I just went in there I was gonna delete the whole video and start all over I said can I delete the video and start over and get new cards and I said no <laughs> Now. 
there's something that has happened. I don't know if I said it before, but they have, um, there's like bigger confirmations after confirmations of them being here. I just haven't posted it on any social media. The first card, and I would say this card is for, this reading's for everyone. This is, um, for me, my twin flame also, so I don't know how it's going to work, but the miracle of Isis. I had to turn the light on. See, it's still in the meeting. Okay. Isis was known as a talented practitioner of the healing arts and was capable of miraculous healing. For you, beloved, she, offered a, she offers a miracle healing. No matter how much you have struggled, with particular matter, no matter how impossible it may seem to imagine your life without this old wound, addiction, problem, relationship, issue, or inner struggle, being part of it, you are guided now to accept the possibilities of miraculous healing, to let go and let the goddess be. The Lady Isis wishes to lift a load has become too heavy for you to heal on your own. Um, beloved, she cannot take something away from you if you're not willing to release it to her, however. Release for healing means trust, letting go of old attachments to outcome and how that outcome might be achieved and opening the divine genius of healing that seeks to express the perfection of divine love through you now. To hand something over for healing, especially when it has been a long time persistent difficulty or simply seems to to be too good or overwhelming to be healed. I think she's healed my son's foot, like, overnight. Yet these are requirements for, you, for us to surrender into the great healing of divine love. So this is kind of like helping, because I can send this to my twin flame, and he can do this work where he's at. And this is... You know, I accept your help, Isis, Cleopatra, to heal me and to heal my twin flame. This is. <laughs> so Lady Isis speaks through this oracle and says, you says that you and that recovery from trauma and emotional healing is not only possible, but if you're willing, it can happen for you now. <clears throat> no matter the depth of grief, loss, despair, fear, or anger, loss can and will absorb all of it. The oracle is also an indication of that indication that a spiritual gift or awakening of deep healing ability at a new level are coming your way. Keep your eyes and heart open and let go of doubt and fear of, about opening up to the new level of proficiency. Proficiency. Why am I doing this with all my words lately? Prophet. <laughs> I'm sorry. Dedicate your work to the divine love and trust that it will flow through you now stronger. You are capable of great work when you trust in your own heart 
and the love of the divine flowing through you with um, total surrender. And then there's a ritual, and I'll post that. The next card is initiation. Oh, she's good. When you are being spiritually initiated into the mysteries of light, love, and power, there are moments of deep challenge. The key is to find the light within the challenge. For advanced aspirants of your path, initiates will occur at various stages. Sometimes your entire life will feel like an initiation. At other times, specific areas will be flowing easily. Others are deeply challenging. This oracle comes as confirmation that you are not you, that you are not needlessly suffering. If you find the light within the struggles, tests, or challenges that face you now, you will experience breakthrough healing. So, of course, you need the initiation to heal the... Right? Huh. As an initiation, this oracle urges you to honor life as a gift and treat any challenge or pressure as a way for you to grow into a brighter and purer light ca um, capable of great spiritual servant of the planet. It's initiation time. <laughs> Temple of Carnelian. I've never studied about the Egyptians. I never knew anything really about the Egyptians, so I'm just learning as I'm going so for them to come to me and find me and harass me the way they do I don't know why who am I <laughs> it, it's me I, I accept them I get scared sometimes it seems like she's been here he, he's like oh, well the light's alone me so we're all been, I think he's like tiptoeing around <laughs> He doesn't want to scare me too much. He, he makes too much noise. Of, of lighting noise, you know. Not. But this girl's need to stop being so scared. How many confirmations do we have to give her that she's protected? <laughs> well, you do certain things and do certain things, you know. Oh, look at that. Watch. There's a, that's an LED light. Um, anybody else have this on YouTube? Temple of Cornelian, entering the fierce belly of Skemet. You have such strength within you. It is time to trust your own boldness and courage. Taking risks that feel true to your heart and engaging in practices that make you feel truly and generally alive, embodied, and more of yourself, even if not always comfortable are going to help you live the life you were born to live. You can do so knowing that the Temple of Carnelian will bring you warm strength, encouragement, and deep trust in your own body wisdom to guide you through any situation relationship that may arise to test you so that you can grow into more of your magnificent self. This call, it calls you to have the courage of your convictions to have faith in yourself and own your process. To be fearless as you are assured of victory. 
Schmidt will not be defeated. Quinny, honey. I will post this on there. Um, I'm gonna do a couple. Quinny, Quinny, Quinny. I am on here. I just did this 45 minutes and I'm done. I just wanna hang up and do this, okay? Let the dog outside. You gotta go to bed, we got school. You got school. I hope this doesn't kick out. All right, Oracle cards, Oracle cards from the Archangel Michael. We'll just um, do a quick shuffle and see, ooh. All is well. Archangel Jeremiah, Jeremiah. Everything is happening exactly as it's supposed to. With hidden blessings, you will soon understand. Leadership. Archangel Gabriel, it's time for you to assume your leadership power and position and lovingly guide others. Oh my goodness. We're gonna... This is it, and I'm done. Oh, that's a lot. Nurture your child and your inner child. Both activities are important for you right now. Sensitivity. You are extra sensitive to energies and emotions right now, so honor yourself and your feelings. Take your power back. Use your God-given power and intentions to manifest blessings in your life. Prosperity. Your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. Counselor. You are a natural counselor. And you may, and many people benefit from your guidance and reassurance. When I was a child, I wanted to be a psychiatrist and get my PhD. I had a trauma that gave me short-term memory loss and it changed my whole entire path. So to get the counselor card is a huge effing deal. I'm sorry I had to rush that at the end. I, I, I don't want this to cut out and I gotta give my daughter a bath, just go to school. And I love you all. I love you all. I'm going to figure out what's next. <laughs> all right. I'm sorry about the lights. Love the lights.